and use him to issue a death threat to uh some other motherfucker that's nearby and you might ask why dominate a new captain when you have others dominated I kinda wanna expand my mind control empire at the same time as I'm farming epic runes is why young pad one let's go get this dude and make him issue a death threat Oh wait, is this uh, some king's foil right here? I believe it is. Some Athelus. Yeah, let's cruise up here and find his ass. Yo, could we get a... Uh can we get a pants status update on the infinite couch? I am wearing shorts of the basketball variety, as I often am, which do not count as pants. So I'm currently pants free. What's going on here? I'm trying to harvest king's foil out here. Manic is wearing jeans. Wow. Fucks up. Glad to see the back of our captain. Even Krug. Yo, here's the home man. Oh no. He's scared now. Don't run. Yo, he can haul ass, dude. Oh my lord. Just teleport over there real quick on ya. Actually, I can grab him now. He's already weak. Okay. Alright, so you are going to issue a death threat to someone else nearby, my new friend. Uh, how about Moogluk the Merciless? What are his strengths and weaknesses? Oh, nice. He looks pretty easy. Yeah. Let's execute his ass. Uh, he's still a wisp, but now he's invulnerable to ranged. I was kind of hoping he would stay that way. Alright, so the next thing I want to do... Get the fuck out of here. Excuse me. That's all I needed here. There's no need to give up your lives. Well, you can see. If you insist. What up in Devin? And Devin says, I literally just got home from work. I haven't changed into my shorts yet. Yo, man. Get on it. If the Osho was on, it is no pants time. And Devin says, do you have combat branding yet? Do I have combat branding yet? 
You tell me, buddy. Alright, so my next setup here is I want to take one of my war chiefs and beef him. Uh, and have him go attack this dude so when I kill him, he's going to get credit for it. Yo, Rook dude, let's power you up, buddy. Tricera Trezor says romance of the seven orcdoms. That's basically a gangbang porno. Lord have mercy. So which is better for torturing? A hot iron or a hammer? Lord have mercy. Yo, when I was in uh, art school in uh, Alabama, I think I remember going to a screening of this porno called Lord of the G-String. I want to say, and it was like a Lord of the Rings themed porno, but because uh, it was like an art house thing, they did it in like a big theater. Alright, let's uh, tell Rook Duke he's got some work. I actually really fucking like Rook Duke's blue armor. Like, it does look swagged out. I get into it, it's over every time. We can see how much cowardice is inside. Alright, and we're gonna send Rook Doog after this death threat, dude. Wugluk is busy insulting another Uruk's honor to show off his own power. Wugluk, you're fucked, man. Despite your cool ass face paint, you're shit out of luck, buddy. Alright, so. Where did that create the riot? Over here? Okay. We'll head over there next. Farm another epic rune. Grab this, uh, Ethelden right here. What is, what is that elf up to back there with the O? Oh. Man. Communist elf propaganda poster is getting spookier and spookier. Oh my god. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Here, I can show you all this now. If you can see real quick, the lovely Sid has fucked around and has actually more experience points than the actual broadcaster me so this is now the Sid show uh, god damn dude well shit Sid is a, a mythic mod blade wielder forever now nice <laughs> Basically, at this point, Sid is such a legendary adventurer that no one would ever dare even try to take the mod blade away, you know what I mean? Sid is like, a, you know how uh, in old school Dungeons and Dragons modules, the uh, all the innkeepers and shit are actually retired like 17th level adventurers 
just to keep the PCs in line. That's Sid right now. He's just chilling on the couch. He's a he's a laid back dude, but in actuality, he's like a 17th level ranger. He's just decided to you know keep it quiet. Hungry Ghost says they added the wild card update for uh, PlayStation 5 Hand of Fate. Hello, Hungry Ghost from the future. Welcome back. Uh, I'm glad you came back in time just to watch the O show. But I, I bet that means it's out on PS4 right now, too. So. Oh, hold up. I think I need to kill a dire Caragor for my survival challenge. I feel like that dude who killed Cecil the lion right now, I feel really terrible. Oh, they're mad. No, actually, they're out of there. And are also mad. At the same time. I feel really guilty on that one. But I had to do the survival challenge. No, no, don't get revenge. Eat the ghouls, not me. No, 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 no. No, no, no. What's my, uh, all right, I'm still after King's Foil and I need a ghoul matron now. That's Oh, there's some king's foil down there. What kind of ranger am I not recognizing king's foil right off the bat? Action 2.0 says, I just bought this game two seconds ago, downloading it now. It looks tons of fun. It's really fun, man. Uh, I've been playing it for the past couple weeks here, several weeks actually, and uh, I really enjoy it. They do a really, the devs did a really good job of implementing a lot more of the original lore from the, the novels instead of the movies. Though there are the requisite fucking appearances by Gollum and, uh, uh, what's her name? Galadriel. But, uh, tons of lore, really nice graphics, really nice gameplay. All in all, it's badass. My only, uh, I guess complaint you could say it would be it's a little bit repetitive but it's not even really a complaint like I really enjoy the gameplay but if you weren't a huge fan of the gameplay you can see it getting repetitive alright let's help uh, Rook do fuck up Mookaluk and uh, we'll get an epic rune hopefully and it'll be better You so much die! You're nothing compared to me, you idiotic worm! Lord Mordor! What was that you said for Gondor? I could have sworn I heard for Gondor. All dominated guys now, right? When there's a, a bunch of the what could you hope to achieve with so many Uruks here? When there's a bunch of Uruks that are on my side, 
In a group like this, and we're taking down one of the captains for the room. I underestimated this time. Uh, it feels like a fucking wrestling match. Wait a minute. He ran away. Okay, well my war chief's still increased in power, but I can kill him still, right? Okay, good. I was like, you better not make him teleport away. I want to kill his ass. Oh, Karagor is helping. There it is. There it is. Alright, epic rune. You what do we got? As you lived. That's a pretty cool rune. Wow, that was actually worth that farming, man. Did y'all see that rune I just picked up? Hot damn. Hold up, I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. I guess you'd be glad I, I fucking muted that. Ugh. Let me stretch, dude. Let me get a nice little stretchy poo in here. Then we'll take a look at this rune. Um, in Devon's here. Since in Devon's here, let's talk. Who's uh? Let's talk about the Minecraft server here a little bit. Let's talk about the Minecraft server here a little bit. For instance, alright, so I mentioned earlier how the anti-grief is going to work. It's tied into the resources. There's going to be factions on the server, right? Let me grab a sip of my brew here. There's going to be factions on the server, and uh... That's like however you want to do it. I mean, you get, you can everyone has their own faction, and then you can uh, team up or lone wolf it or whatever you want to do. The reason there's factions is there's going to be kind of PvP in the no man's lands between settlements. So basically, like highway bandits. Or, I mean, you don't have to engage in the PvP. That's the thing with the faction system. I mean, you will be vulnerable as you're traveling, but, uh, you know, you can, you can either, you can, like, tunnel, whatever, you know, avoid the PvP entirely. Uh, there's going to be an arena that's kind of the admin faction. And uh, you're going to be able to bet your experience points on arena battles. And on the Minecraft server, because I'll be streaming probably a good amount of Minecraft. Not like all the time. I like to keep the variety going, but uh, I'm really looking forward to it, man. Alright, I don't care about that last chance shit, so. Go down to it. And swap it for the Blade of Gondolin. I think these epic runes might be worth fucking with a little bit here, because that's pretty good. Festivore says Highway Bandit or Highway Saboteur. That depends on how much gunpowder you farmed, uh, my friends. Just as a quick, like, little uh, show of appendages here. For those of you chilling on the infinite couch this lovely Tuesday evening, how many of y'all are actually, like, planning on playing on the Minecraft server we're opening up? I'm just curious. You know, I think I want to farm a couple more epic runes if that if I can get one that fucking good. Because that means I don't really have to save the storm of Urfrael power at all. And I gotta remember, I've got the the 
turbo bow action too, where I can. Jeez. I never want to have to be in the Udo now. Cowboys playing, Overlords is us playing, Triceratops is playing, Miller's playing, Minoff's playing, Jim's playing, JC is playing, and Devin will hopefully play as administrator. Ninth Gate's in there. That's that's a good amount of people, dude. Uh, I'm really looking forward to it because with the faction system, it can go a lot of ways. Like, uh, I'm thinking about being, like, a villain, man. I might be, like, an evil faction if someone wants to join the Dark Overlords. Uh, I'm really looking forward to it. I'm gonna try to get it set up before the end of the week. Because, uh, Bean Sister's not visiting till next week now, so... Got a little bit of time. I had a great day today, productivity-wise. I got so much done. And with this hip adjustment, like, my hip was out of the socket and it got put back in. Uh, when I went to the gym, I like effortlessly put an extra mile onto the cycle in the same amount of time. Like it made that much of a difference in my strength level. So I was like, God damn. All right, so what captain do I want to hunt next? <clears throat> well, first off, what war chief do I want to power up? Uh, we can power up Rook Doog again, though he's not really close to me. Well, he's as close as anybody else. Uh, so first I gotta issue the death threat, right? So let me find a close by somebody to issue this death threat with. I'll just use Krook, right? Because he's nearby and he's already dominated, right? That should work. So we'll go visit Krook, we'll have him issue a death threat for me. Then we'll go grab a war chief, and then we'll kill another captain, farm another rune. Devin says, I'm thinking of leading a faction whose goal is to just scatter the land with temples and vaguely religious looking statues. Yeah, well, that would be kind of cool if the admin faction was like a, a cult. Yo, do I have a dominated dude right here? Shit, I'll just have him do it. That would be kind of groovy, I would like that. But it's just, you know, it's just gonna be whatever. Hey. All right, who's nearby that's gonna get death threaded? Yo, this dude's pretty nearby. I'm Oog Pain Lover. Uh, and he's pretty, he's got a lot of fears and vulnerabilities. The, he doesn't like flies, burning, anything. Eh. He goes Super Saiyan, he gets a gang. Still got that fear of burning and vulnerable to stealth, so he's kind of fucked. Uh, then I want to use it as an opportunity to power up the war chief. I don't know if I even need to do that. It just seems wise to have powerful war chiefs. So let's go. Who's nearby? Could go grab Rook Dug again. Yeah, we'll power up Rook Dug just because his armor is so cool looking. <laughs> And we'll tell Rookdoog to uh, go fuck up Amug. And we'll get another epic rune and hopefully it'll be just as badass as the other ones I've been farming so far.
Cowerson, were you yelling at me like how to play the game? That's so cute. Don't do that, Cowerson. You're better than that. You're better than that. By the way, if y'all are just dropping in here, man, it is hour two of the O Show. Been chilling back, putting in some more progress in Shadow of Mordor. Right now I'm uh, powering up my War Chiefs and farming epic runes. Uh, then I'll progress the plot a little bit more, just did a story mission a little bit ago, but I hope your Tuesday going well. I definitely cannot complain. I hope you don't have too many complaints either. And as always, I definitely appreciate y'all spending some time chilling on the infinite couch. If you're new to the channel, I encourage you to uh, take a look at the info down below the video. It'll explain this mess. Go fuck up Amug Pain Lover. Alright. Here we go. That'd be fun. Whatever type of rune I'm gonna get this time. Ghost says, I fucking love War Chief introduction so much, just the screaming of their name by an orc heavenly choir. The, only what's left is the chanting of the captain and War Chief names is like such a badass little touch. It's, just, it's like a simple thing that's very, very cool. That's one of the real big strengths of Shadow of Mordor is. All the immersive little touches, they kind of add up. To make it just like a really... It's an experience that kind of sucks you in. Especially because there's so many different little things to do. Time kind of flies, you just like, you turn into a fucking... Gondorian Ranger for a couple hours. And if you're a Lord of the Rings fan and can pick up on the lore and shit like that, it's even better. Really have enjoyed it like a lot more than I thought I would. I'd, I watched the, I think Lyric play it actually. So, you know, no shitting on Lyric, but uh, definitely didn't get the most immersive experience from watching it. So, uh, playing it myself and taking my time and getting into the lore and shit, been badass. Get us another uh, epic rune.
You're no good. Nothing but grief and bother. I'll rip your tongue out and feed it to you. Make them scream. Yo, is it tongue supposed to be pretty good to eat, actually? I think I've had hella people tell me, like, lingua, isn't that what it is? Like, tongue, that's hella good. So maybe ripping out a dude's tongue and feeding it to him wouldn't be such a bad thing. Do you like fire? No, uh, you're vulnerable to range. Okay. Run away! He didn't drop an epic, the bastard. Thus ends your command. You bastard. You were supposed to drop an epic rune, buddy. You didn't. Fremen said, what other games would benefit from a nemesis system? Uh, Haven't you brought that up before? Either you or someone else has. And when I really thought about it, I actually couldn't think of too many. Like... How do I say this? Like, adding RNG elements to any game would make it better. But... It's too cold! Um, it's too wet! It's too dark! What are you complaining about? You know, like, RNG stuff is... <laughs> difficult to add to games because you have to generate so much content. So if it's like a simple thing, like um, Binding of Isaac, for instance, pretty easy to add a lot of RNG because you can generate a lot of content easily. But in a game like as complex as you know Mordor, for instance, uh, it takes a lot more like effort, aka money, to add in all that RNG element. Well, that's probably the the reason there's not a lot of it. And there's also the fact that you know in the market. People don't like RNG because it's hard sometimes, right? Well, there's also that. Alright, who's the next captain on the menu? I'm like running out of dudes I have intel for. Those dudes are far away. Do I have any intel in the vicinity? Fremen says, wasn't me, but we did discuss it. I just wanted to see some joke answers. Well, that's good, man. The, the O show is about 50% uh, joke answers and 50% serious answers. Oh, uh, yeah, there's some intel up here. Let me grab that. That blacksmith won't fix me weapons properly. Because he don't know how. Oh, what's that? It's 
learn about some more captains here. Ashgarn, the hunter. Yo, he looks pretty cool. He's angry that the slaves are not working harder. He's, he's a manager, Uruk. I like it. He's, he's the uh, executive type. He doesn't like cats. And you don't get any last chance on him. That's that's the motherfucker right there. Alright, where's he located at? Crosshair Trezor says Ashgarn is sick. What a hard ass. Yeah, he looks pretty badass. Make no mistake. Yo, there's like multiple captains just chilling back up at Toll Crossing. And executioners watch like a bunch of little cowards. Alright. Get a little bit more intel going here. I saw some more in the area. Okay, grab that one. Kill the intel guy. Oh, uh, don't run. Fedora Lord says, I wonder if orc women are sexy. You know, you typed IRC women first, and I was like, I've met some sexy women on IRC. Yeah. But uh, there are no orc females. You see, orcs are bon born from a spawning pit. Uh, so there are no Uruk ladies, unfortunately. Noruk the Merciless is yearning for a chance at violence. He's scared of being on fire and cats. Yo, he's got the no chance trait too. Like, this is some bullshit. He's got beautiful blue eyes though. Noruk does. Alright, that captain's pretty close by, so... I got another war chief I want to power up here. Yeah, let's go ahead and take Rook Dug all the way up to 20, all right? So we'll go visit Rook Dug again, tell him the good news, and then we'll go kill another captain and hopefully get an epic rune this time. Though to be fair, it's the only time so far that an epic hasn't dropped. So. The good ranger never leaves 
King's foil behind. The case nearby. We should send a couple slaves in there and see if we hear them scream. If there's grounds hiding in them, I don't need no. Fedora says, "What a pussy! Who is afraid of being on fire?" Yo, I'm actually on fire right now. Listen to how calm I sound. Everybody get ready to chant it. Down Noruk the Merciless. Ha! <laughs> what a coward. Scared of being on fire. Ha! <laughs> so weak. Pathetic. Ghost says, God, this game has such great sound design. Yo, man, this game has such great everything design, to be honest. I think something just moved. Nah, you're hallucinating. Nothing moved. Give it. You keep your eyes open and try not to die. Speak for yourself. Who's the idiot here in Bell? Festivore says Rukdug doesn't have a sweet hat or helmet. Truly a shame. Well, Rukdug has some swagged out blue armor that I feel like, if you look at the aesthetic value, makes up for it, alright? If you compare the uh, international aesthetic units of the two options, they come out to be equivalent. Devin says, Rook Duke's all like, resist? The fuck, boss? Just ask me for stuff. Don't gotta get all spooky every time you need something. I know, it's fucked up that Talion, even once he's dominated the Uruk, he hates Uruk so much that he like insists on fucking holding his dagger to their throat every time and being like, alright. The dominated Uruk's like, I'll just do it. You don't have to do this every time. And Talion's like, this is not for you. This is for me. Just let the archers take them down. They like to play with them and make them dance about. Alright. Rinse and repeat. Let's farm another epic rune. This has been kind of fun chilling here and farming epic runes. Doing the occasional quests. So much die! My boys have been taking bets on how I'll kill you. Damn, I kind of wish Noruk was on my team. Noruk is a badass. Oh well.
accidentally shot an arrow. Get over here, maggot! I'll break your hands and then I'll kill you! Damn. I'm like, I want Nuruk on my team instead. Just for swag, you know? Another non epic rune. Can't well, I think I'm gonna stop farming him then. You know? And can all let us be for once? This must be the Grave Walkers! Let's, uh. Go do. A main mission. Sounds fun to me. Fall. I like uh, how y'all were talking about on the infinite couch putting. Uh, Shadow of Mordor model into GTA 5, but I actually like post-processing idea even better of putting Grand Theft Auto 5 people into Mordor. That would be even better. If I could instead of Talion, if I could play as Trevor, I would be really happy. Cave sounds very comforting. Oh, I don't want to go in here at all. I don't think. Nope. Look at fancy me trying to take a shortcut. Oh yeah. It's time. Yo, help me out here. Get that guy. Greg the Grog is back. Can I eat these? are basically like growled potato chips. Oh, I killed them all. JC says, time to visit a stronghold. Yeah, I might as well I'll go... There's one of the subway. Uh oh. I bring down fortresses. What are you? Just a man. No, I'm actually a man and a growl. He goes Super Saiyan when he sees a growl. War Chief, help me. Did you give me a hand out here? Thank you. <laughs> I 
All those whiffs back to back. Nice. Grog's like, I don't care what war chief I hit, I'm gonna smash everybody, I don't give a shit. Eat him! Good Grog. Don't eat him! No! Put down that war chief, Greg. Did you drop the, did you drop the war chief through the world, Greg? Greg, why did you drop the war chief through the world? You ate him! You weren't supposed to eat him! Greg! You you weren't yo. Oh, he was just a captain, good. You can't eat my dominated captains like that, Greg. For fuck's sake, man. Bad boy, dude. Do not eat. Do all right. Look, Greg. The gl blue glowy guys that look like you. Don't eat them. Eat him. Eat this guy. He's fine to eat. There you go. There you go. Eat that one. That's a good one to eat. Eat him up. You're a growing boy, you gotta eat all your Urukai. I like how you can build combo on the Graug and then jump off and uh, use it. Wiki says, Greg, you dick. <laughs> Greg's a bad boy, man. Graugs these days. Don't touch me. Are your legs tired? Here, I'll get rid of them for you! Do you wanna... Are you sure you want this? Alright. Rest in pieces. Greg, you're doing work, man. Get some snacks here. Pick them up. There's no shooting me off this crowd. What do you what do you think you're doing here? Eat the orcs, I don't want you to die. I gotta jump off here and pick up these runes. You gotta take care of yourself, Greg. Eat him up. Good boy. Him. Don't let him throw axes at you. There you go. Alright, you hang out there for a second, big guy. <laughs> Cowboy says, man, Greg's getting some good protein in tonight. I know, man. Look, Greg's looking swole. He left. Greg! Greg's like, I'm done. 
Got all the captain protein I needed. Nice. Catch you later, Greg. It was real, bud. He just cruises off into the horizon. That's my stuff over there, fellas. Excuse me. Wait. I'll smell something. Probably smell the arrow in your face. That's probably what you're smelling. Ooh, we got an ability point. Man, that was a fun little time with Greg the Grog. Grogs are always fun times. Let me stretch my little hands here a little bit, boys and girls. Hope everyone's doing well. I'm doing great. I'm out of beer here. I think, uh. Maybe we'll take a little break here, man. I've been at it for like two and a half hours. Took a quick break. Sounded pretty good. Let's, uh, spin this ability point and melt some runes. Uh. I think I'd like quick draw as much as I use the bow. Ghost says, I'm going to assume the Graugs are also British. So Greg's like, I say, Italian. These Uruks are most unmannered. Yeah, a lot of my runes on my bow actually suck ass. <laughs> uh, let's ditch this one and replace it with the health back on headshots. Those are all pretty good. L shot back on a combat brand. Uh, nah. I was debating on that one a little bit. All right, so I think we'll take our uh, first break of the evening here. Awesome. Hope y'all are doing well, man. It is the O Show. Uh, having a lovely Tuesday evening here. I hope you are too. We're going to take a little break here.
whenever I take a break. I try to encourage y'all to take a break too, man. Stretch. Refresh your beverage. Touch an animal. Uh, you know, do something good with yourself. Take care of yourself. I'm gonna do the same. I'm gonna refresh my uh, my beer here. Walk around a little bit. Visit the kitty. Really appreciate you all chilling on the infinite couch. If you are a Patreon scrub scriber, I want to remind you to go and suggest some games for sub day. Uh, and we're doing another gimmick day on Saturdays. Saturdays we're going to play multiplayer games with me, of course, Dave, and Saturday. See how clever I am? Alright, y'all. We'll be back with you shortly. If you're new, check out the info down below the video. If you're old, check it out anyway, because there's probably something new. I'll be back in a minute.
the timing though. Thanks for your patience, man. Uh, my kitty is finally kind of warming up to the new place. I was indulging in a little kitty petting. Hope you're all doing well. Hope you did something for yourself during the break. I got my last beer. And a little bit of Woodford Reserve here. I'm gonna sip real quick before we dive back in. Uh, so status report here. Been live for coming up on three hours. Eleven. I don't know how long I'm gonna stream tonight. Tonight might be like the five hour, four hour range or something. I'm a little bit tired. But we'll see, man. We'll see. I always say that and then I stream for like eight hours, so we'll see. That is some delicious bourbon. Appreciate y'all chilling. Play some more, some more door. Steak says I'm down for a long stream. I'm gonna be up all night. Yeah. But what about me, Steak? What about my comfort, my feelings? Huh? What about those things? Really the question is, uh, when I get done playing Mordor, what should I play later on, man? Cowboy says you should just go to bed right now, get 14 hours of sleep, and feel good. Nah, I gotta, I gotta stream for the people, cowboy. I gotta stream for the people. Thanks says Blood Bowl and Devin says Blood Bowl. I love playing Blood Bowl, but I feel like I'm uh, boring y'all to death by like literally the O show right now is Mordor Blood Bowl, Mordor Blood Bowl, Mordor Blood Bowl. But, you know, the other thing is, I've noticed the Osho kind of is seasonal like that. They'll be like, they'll be like a smorgasbord of games that I'm into, and that slowly shifts over time, and it's kind of cool, actually. So... Fuzzy says Darkest Dungeon. Main. Uh, I will honestly probably play Blood Bowl 2 later. If you want the honest truth. Um, but I'm, sooner or later I'm going to play some Warhammer online. And that, that could be tonight.
Sorry about that. Alright, I want to go advance the plot. Like, on the O Show, I endeavor to hit it up with a variety of games, you know? Instead of doing that thing which some folks do where they try to, like, play one game all the time and, like, dominate the category and, like, maximize their growth and yada and yada. Um, I much prefer to show off a variety of games. However, there's also the element of playing what I want to play and recently man I wanted to play a lot of Mordor and a lot of Blood Bowl maybe I just have an orc fetish Hey. Y'all get out of the way. And Devin says, you've told me straight up before, stream for yourself. Don't feel obligated and just stream what you want to play. Yeah, yeah, I know. There is that. But I do, you know, I do consider what the uh, infinite couchlings might want to see. But you're right, man. You just follow my heart. I mean, besides, we have a uh, sub day where the scrub scribers get to flat out pick what I play, so. You know? In her desperation to help her mother, Lothariel has been infiltrating the Uruk strongholds. She's not returned since leaving on her last mission. Oh no! Such a shame. If you truly know nothing, then you're of no use to me. <laughs> the fucking tower, dude. When you're done with her, hang her high. Make sure the Grave Walker can find her. <laughs> you aren't going anywhere, Slack. Tell us where it's hiding, and we'll kill you quick. <laughs> You slowly, just how I like it. Obligatory. We must find her quickly. Stay quiet. Emotion will add weight to your step. 
damsel in distress rescue mission. Here, all of her men have fallen. That is why we must help her. She has no one left by her side. How did you see me? No, 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 no. No, no, no. No alarm raising. Let's all just join my team. Very good. Let's go get her, boys. Bleed a little, she'll start talking. Oh, down on her knees. Spit out the truth before I wake you. Spit out your luck. Where is it? Catch me a Walker. Here I am. Oh, I didn't do the combo. That's not very chill. Carry her to safety. They forced me to watch as they killed my men, one <laughs> after another. I can put her down. We must hurry. The Uruks rally when their brethren fall. So will my tribe. Plan your vengeance once we have escaped. I don't seek vengeance. I fight because it would be wrong not to. Alright, Lothario, we're out of here. Let's go. Oopsie. Gotta be more careful. <laughs> Well, this is a great. This is lovely. Whoop! Oh, sorry. Talion, I can no longer draw my sword. Then I will do so in your stead. Oh, I see how this works. Ah. Damn, uh, Buzzy says, Lothariel, you're drunk. You have the warrior spirit. I've never met a fighter with such vigor for battle. I have no choice. In the face of darkness, it is our duty to bring light. Ghost says, I'm not super informed on Middle Earth lore and shit. So the only thing I know is Uruks hate orcs. Uruks are orcs. Just another name for them. And uh, basically, big Uruks hate small Uruks. All Uruks hate each other. Uruks are uh, chaotic evil to the core. So they all hate each other. Tons of betrayal. Backstabbing, all that type of good stuff. Steady, I'm here. Let's make haste. 
My leg is broken, not my spirit. The Tower of Sauron interrogated me on your whereabouts, but I did not betray you. Then you have proven my faith. As you now prove mine. The horde is endless. My sword can only take so many. Well then don't use your sword. Use your bow, silly boy. I was expecting my like uh, nominated dudes to, to come in with the assist on that one. And Devin says Urukai are the higher ones, and they're made from elves. Where standard Uruk and orcs are usually made of men and other races. Yeah, that's a pretty good way to put it. And Devin usually has the good explanation. Uh, why are you doing this? To stop the bleeding. No. Why did you come back to save me? I had a family once. A wife. And a son. And I buried them along with everyone I even knew. Stay with us. My mother can help you. I can't. I don't belong here. You will be a champion to my people. Over there! Can you walk on your own? Is that your answer? Milady! Help her! Let me help. You need to leave this place immediately. It's not safe. Oh, the slow mo sword put away. Triceratroser says the uruk high are just the ones with the dank butt. Yo man, that reminds me. Post processing says I can parkour, but the D be cold as the grave. Lothariel and her men will not survive Mordor. They must leave or perish. The Black Hand will suffer for this. I mean, Talion is a corpse, so she would have to be down with some. Supreme freakiness to holler at it. Uh, I want to keep advancing the plot some here. The game doesn't seem to like lock you out of collecting stuff and doing side quests at any point. I'm gonna go ahead and cruise over to this mission.
Manic says, is Talion being a corpse a thing that other people know? It's kind of, that's the one plot point that's kind of weird to me. Uh, people don't seem to realize that Talion is a corpse. But he is possessed by the Wraith of Celebrimbor. So maybe because of that, he has like life force sustaining him or some shit. I like the utter disdain with which Talion just threw that uh, throwing knife. He was like disgusted. JC says it seems like Hirgon realized Talion had superpowers given how valuable he thought Talion would be to the outcast cause. Um, you may have a good point there, but I don't think anyone suspects Talion's dead. But that's kinda... So wouldn't, wouldn't have the... Like wouldn't the fact that Talion's family died have been, you know, like reported and been kinda common knowledge? Like, I don't know. That plot point is kind of completely ignored. Your forces await your command. The time has come to launch your assault against the Black Hand. JC says, I suspect it was reported to Gondor, especially since Talion's wife is the daughter of a noble. And Talion's the captain of the Gondorian Watch, too, so... Like, it seems like it would be common knowledge that he'd be de he's dead. However, people just act like it's normal for him to be alive. But maybe they think they got bad intel, or... I don't really know. That part of the plot's a little convoluted. Let's be real. We wish to thank you for coming to our aid, Captain. Aye. I never realized my smuggling could be so appreciated by the Queen. <laughs> Lady. They're here. Orcs. Oh, they make bad passengers. But I've carried worse. Lady. Queen Mo. It's good to see you in better health. The boats are ready. The skippers have been briefed on your destination. Good. How long will those orcs obey you? Well, I should think as long as I like. I'm in your debt. We owe you our lives, Tony. Just put an end to this madness. My lady. Now we're officially orc pirates. Oh, 
I see in the future the shadow that will cover Middle Earth. The Grave Walker is a tiny flame. We are the poison sea. We will spill misery out across Mordor. We will wash away the light. Drown the air with Uru Christ and the earth with Uru blood. For Middle Earth. Well, this is pretty cool. So my nemesis is Malmug Grog Catcher. I want to look at his shit. Explosions and combat finishers. Okay. Cowboy says that dude is the generic orc they choose if you don't have a living nemesis. <laughs> I'm such a hard ass that my nemesis didn't even survive. Is that what you're telling me? Nah, none of none of that. I know what it's time for. Here shortly. Come here, bud. Nemesis. Let's go. of the Black Hand. Oh shit. I guess maybe I should have done more side quests. It seems like I'm like at the end of the game. <laughs> what rune did I get right here? 31% damage increase when hitting an enemy from behind. That's uh no, nah, I'm gonna melt it. Yo, can someone who's played through Mordor before uh confirm for me when he all on the infinite couch? Uh can I leave this map? Or like am I locked into the end game now? Does anybody have a uh Confirm or deny on that one for me. If you're just joining us, by the way, we've been chilling here playing some Mordor for about three hours. Um, Cowboy says you're locked in. Oh, damn. JC says once you finish this mission, you should go back to the mainland. I... This is a trap. This silence taunts us. What sorcery is at work here? You mean you don't want me to finish Mordor right now? You would be sad to see Mordor go if I finished it? Is that what you're telling me, JC? In a roundabout way? Expecting you. It's a hollow. I hope my soldiers gave you a welcome. Where are you? 
Show yourself! This is the work of the Tower. The Black Hand went looking for you. But it will give me great pleasure to take you myself. That Bow throne. to me. Bow to me. What a hard ass. And I will deliver you to the Dark Lord. Unspoiled. We bow to no one. <laughs> the Dark Lord forgives you, Galabrimbor. Return to him. And cast off this human corpse. Stand up and fight. There's no need, Ranger. Kellabrimbo huh. is your curse. He chose you. Silence! He can release you at any time. <laughs> yes, that's all you are, Ranger. A vessel for the Ringmaker. Fuck Kellabrimbor, dude. Why didn't you die without What do you still fight for? Festivore says the tower is my favorite character in this game. Yeah, the scene is really cool. That's why I'm shutting the fuck up during it. You will never see your family again. Italian won the force duel. You said we would try. 
Ghost. You deceived me. It was Sauron's doing. This was your doing! I should have died with my family. I thought you wanted revenge. I can leave you. But there is only one way to close the circle. The Black Hand remains. Not for long. Never trust an elf. Let it be learned. Let it be known. Stay still, my heart. The wound is deep. Oh, the Karagor is worse. I promise you that. Are you certain? Perhaps he enjoyed a free meal. That little bite. Barely a scratch. Nun is in flames. We must return to Queen Marwen. The Black Hand has been here. I can feel it. Lothario. Alright, so it looks like the next part of the game is going to have me going back to the other map, maybe? Um, but I think what I'll do is I'll do some more collectible type stuff here. And then uh, I think we'll probably switch games. I'm starting to feel like that I don't have too many more hours in me. Uh, yo, and Devin. Are you trying to play a Blood Bowl match later on, my man? Uh, now that I see that my, like, homies actually show up in battle, I'm gonna fucking dominate, like, everybody. <laughs> and maybe even farm an epic rune or two here if I can. Sebatum says, Nern is on fire. Better run around and collect shit before that. Exactly. That's game logic, Sebatum. And Devin, young man, pay attention to me. Do you want to play a Blood Bowl match after this in Devin? I know you mentioned earlier you were trying to play. Alright, alright. And Devin says, I'm totally looking to show the power of the reptiles of the year that have never played a game. Well, shit. What team value? Are they 1,000? Are they team... Are they 1,000 TV? In Devon, I, uh, I yeah, I've got some fresh teams. I guess I could play. Yeah, we'll worry about it later. We'll worry about it later. And Devin says one thousand TV. Yeah, that's what I thought the starting lizard lineup was. Yeah, we'll get it figured out. And Devin says, you've got like three teams we can go at it with. Yeah, but like... You know, the only team I ever really want to play is like Orcs. Whoa. Did you guys see that? <laughs> There's one way to... Uh, Activate the Nemesis system. 
There's one way to do it. <laughs> you can just... <laughs> Italian was like, you know, I haven't died in a while, so let me just die real quick. Cool, man. Fun, you know? You worked with Sauron. You forged the rings of power at his side. Our motives were the same. To heal a land wounded by war. My weakness was to be seduced by evil that seemed fair. He is the master of lies. Later, kid. Thanks for chilling, man. Have a good day at work. Well, uh, let me go grab this intel here. You know, to learn about all these lovely new captains we have. Can I get a back scratch? Here it is. Alright, hold up. He's gonna scratch my back for me. And Devin says, I think you can legit just wait at the towers and make time pass for captains to gain power and stuff. Or you can uh, clip into a torch and fall through the world, too. <laughs> Post processing says he's scratching your nipple through your back. Yeah, well, he, he looks like he's reaching through my armpit and doing like a little. Little doo -doo -doo. <laughs> I like it. Ah, uh, the emo Urukai I forgot. Zugor Bright Eyes. Ook Book the Immovable is eager to battle another captain in a public arena. You mean like a debate? He's a little bit of a toughie. Vulnerable to stealth and range, though. What up, Marine Madness? How's it going, man? Hope you're doing well. He can't be that tough. Get a little more intel flowing here. Good to be informed. Got angry kitties. No, no, no. Bad kitties. Oh, wow. Ah! Kitties. Bad kitties, no, no.
Naughty kitties. Cut it out. Kitties, get the orcs, please. There we go. There we go. Some bad kitties right there. That little clip right there, My Eyes Are Yours, it reminded me of one of my favorite songs. Now, there's this metal band. You may have heard of them, but if you haven't, you're going to be shocked by their name. The metal band is called Goat Whore. And the song it reminds me of is the classic, My Eyes Are the Spears of Chaos. Tuka Slash Face. He's afraid of the wrath. Of the black captains. He's also scared of cats. And vulnerable to many things though. And he's vampiric. He's a little tough one too. Triceratrezer says goat whore. Uh, it's all one word though. So it's all together. Goat whore. And the song is called My Eyes Are the Spears of Chaos. You guys should listen to it right now. I bet one of you will like Goat Horror. Probably not more than one. Are you eating my intel guy? Uh, let me get him. Yeah, eat him. Alright, I'm out. Why you no go up? That time I got promoted. The go. only way the captain will do that is if I kill the largest drow I can find. Uh, go do. Look, another Zeus death. Zeus cannot stay alive in this game. I think Zeus is chilling on the infinite couch right now. Zeus, we're getting killed. Zeus says I always try to get a 25 root, okay? <laughs> alright, it's alright this time, Zeus. These hungry men dared steal some food. Free them so they can rejoin Lothariel's company. Ledge kill? If you want meat, you should have been born an Uruk. The Ranger, push it down. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, he's 
idiot, nice. Blood and violence! The courage of men indeed! I got ya! How do you got me? not gonna do here, okay? I want to push you off ledges, Rooks. All right, that's all. You don't have to get all bent out of shape about it. Like you're a good candidate, right? Right on the ledge. An archer up here somewhere. Anybody? Who wants to get ledge killed? And Devin says, I was going to ask, is it an actual charge to join the Minecraft server? Or do you just have to have a standing amount above 420? No, I'm going to have it where you have to pay, uh, you have to give up 420 XP. Like it's a deduction. Slowly but surely, I'm going to come up with other things to spend XP on too. I gotta do everything for this guy. I just want a ledge skill in Uru, man. I didn't get to ledge skill any of them. You ruined it, man. Oh, maybe I can get this one up here. Yeah? Perfect. What? That didn't count. Oh, does the ledge kill mean get him from like hanging, maybe? That is some bull drive. Well, I think the mobs will respawn, so. Let's see if that's what it wants me to do for the bonus objective. My dinner is in your belly. Maybe I'll just cut it out. Why did you have to come down here, man? I was about to ledge kill you. Bro. Last night I dreamt of a man, beautiful and terrible. Cut me down! This pain will kill me. Yeah, yeah, here you go. What did he do? Did I just say something? Many thanks, stranger! I want to get this bonus objective, right? A corpse. You're talking to yourself, man. <laughs> this guy. He's alone. He's like, someone's around here. <laughs> Look at him. The killer's on the loose. Who are you talking to, man? It's just you and me, bud. I think something just moved.
Uh, okay, we got a couple more here. Y'all need to climb up on the ledge for me, please. Oh, yo, maybe I can attract them up here. Right? Like, can I use arrows to be a noise maker? Right? Now they'll come investigate it. Will they not come investigate that? Damn it. It's almost like he moves with the wind. One of these days he's gonna be right there waiting. Nah, he doesn't notice that. Damn it. I think I'm shit out of luck on this bonus objective. Well I tried, man. I tried, alright? Conservative says let's kill the slave. <laughs> Before I get half a whiff of the range, I'll have him on his knees with his heart cut out and no time. Can you even kill the slaves with your special powers? I don't think you can kill the slaves even if you want to. All you can do is knock them over. I wish slaves could just accept their fight. Do what he's doing around camp. That dog is not giving me any help. Right? I can't kill this guy. Wait. You just knock him over. You've got to save us. I gotta get the killing slaves mod, right? Freedom. Post processing says you can release kitties, don't they kill slaves? Yo, y'all are fucked up, right? Them rumors about rights leaping from the sky. Well, I'm a corpse. I don't have to eat, so can't help you there. Someone's sneaking about. No, 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 bad kitty. Get away, kitty. Damn it, kitty. No. Bad kitty, stop it. Bad? No, no. Oh lordy. Bad kitty. We gotta find you something to snack on here, okay? There you go, there you go. Eat those. Very good. No, why? They were like, that morsel was not nearly enough. We crave the flesh of the grave walker. Uh, 
cut it out. There. <laughs> Leave me alone, kitty. Lordy. Eat that orc. Conservative said, imagine if the Uruks learned to ride kitties like the dwarf did, this game would be over. I am kind of sad that the uh, Uruks don't seem to fuck around with wargs at all, you know? Some captured tribesmen have been strung up for looking directly in the eye of their master. Find them and cut them free. Headshots, eh? I like headshots. Go for the sniper shot here. Can I get a headshot from here? Wasn't too bad at all. Alright, what's my current survival challenge? Still need a ghoul matron, blue milk, Elgaran, Winuil. All chiefs is dropping like flies with the Grey Walker around. No way I wanna be one now. <laughs> Notorious <laughs> says, Damn, Davo, that was a 420 no scope if I ever saw one. What are you staring the 420 no scope is way better than the 360. Don't mind my on fire sword. Are you really here to save us all? Don't give up. Give me that intel, boy. Thank you very much, Urukai. Brog the Devourer. He's hungrily longing to become a war chief someday. Someday soon. Is that what you think, Brog? Uh, he's a bit of a toughie, but he's vulnerable to explosions, which is a rough one.
Post processing says I'm an intelligent warrior, Gyrel. I'm a bargist, Gyrel. I like how the Uruk are just like, yeah, he's cool. Uh oh, now they realize the jig is up. Pong. Oh, I'm out. Y'all are really shooting at the Grave Walker? Like, that seems like a terminal mistake, man. I'm trying to like do swag moves now. Here's a swag move. Look at him running. There's no running. Oh, they got away. Oh no! You're next, you better run! Let darkness fall! He's run off! Yo, know, branding is filthy. Like, it's just, you just casually. Mind control everyone you encounter. Like, it's no big deal. Like, get that guy, you know. That one. Then you just leave. 
<laughs> Alright, Joe, uh, I think, uh, I think if I'm gonna do a Blood Bowl match, it's gonna need to be right now. I don't know though, I tell y'all what, I'm actually pretty tired, like... I know this will be an unpopular choice, but I think four hours might be it today, y'all. I think we're just gonna do a four hour one, man. I think I'm... I think we're good. I think that's it, man. I think that's the whole O show. I'm sorry to say. Snake says no blood bowl. Nah, man. I think that's gonna be it tonight. Mewdy says four hours is a long time in a row. Anyhow, don't kill yourself, dog. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Alright, so I think that's gonna do it, man. We'll just do a shorter one tonight here. Four hours. I rode like eight and a half miles today, I think, which is why I'm so tired. Uh, though I might wind up playing some kind of multiplayer shit, uh... Afterward. But it has been real... As always, man, definitely appreciate y'all choosing to spend some time chilling on the infinite couch. We got a couple quick little bits of uh, Osho business to attend to before I sign off here. The first and foremost is I'd like to thank the illustrious members of the uh, 420 Club. Kit Wu, Steak Wonder, Bean Chan 99. Antique Cowboy, Debatum, Sims Magic, Notorious, Ninth Gate, Smarms, Nante, Manic Volcanic, Dennis Kulik, and Devin, Chibotech, and Cameron Clark. Big ups to y'all. Congratulations on being a part of the 420 Club. Definitely do appreciate it. Speaking of, if you are... A Patreon scrub scriber, make sure you get over there, suggest some games for a scrub day, a sub day coming up, and uh, keep your eyes peeled for the info on the Minecraft server soon, I'm looking forward to that as well. Now the uh, final bit of Osho business here is I always take a look at uh, who I follow on Twitch and try to find y'all another chill broadcast to check out. Marie Madness says I'm guessing the list did an update. Uh, if you're talking, oh here we go. One more member of the 420 Club, Bryce Smith. There we go. It updated. We just got a new member. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. I refreshed it before I read it, but it added you uh, after I refreshed it. That was weird. One more time. Alright, here we go. Uh, if y'all are looking for... Some more Twitch to watch here. Go check out B BZ Plasma. He's the homie. Uh, he's playing some Fear. Dude. And actually, Fear, if you've never played it, uh, I played it back in the day when it came out. Fear is actually one of my favorite FPSs. So check out BZ if you're uh, not quite satiated. I'm going to get some rest. And I'll probably be streaming at least a little something tomorrow. I try to get a little something in there every day. 
Appreciate y'all chilling. Marie says I'll have to change my name. May want to. You may want to. But I appreciate it either way, no matter what name you type in there. Alright, y'all. Thanks for chilling. It's been real, as always. And I'll catch you next time.